Hey Pony Pals, it's Emma from Paint Pony Studios, and today we're doing something a little bit different. Um, my mother's account on, Briard, on Briar's website was actually chosen to receive Acadia. Um, so Acadia actually came last week, and I was way too excited to open him, and my boyfriend is over here, and we didn't have any time to uh, film it, actually, so I opened him off camera. But I'm going to show you guys Acadia right now. Here she is. So this is Acadia. This is the third horse in the um, National Parks web series, the America the Beautiful web series from Briar for 2017. And he is absolutely stunning. He's everything that I've wanted to see in a Vallegro. Um, my ideal horse is chestnut blue eyes stockings. You know, so this guy was just a must-have for me. Even if I, even if we weren't drawn, I probably would have picked him up on the second-hand market. Um, probably would have looked for him at Briarfest this year, actually, at the room sales. But as you can see, and I'll put him a little bit towards the camera, very, very rich coloring. Lots of dapples. And I'll make sure to put some better pictures up at the end of this video so you guys can see exactly what he looks like, um, right down to the true color, because in here, the yellow lighting makes it difficult to actually see his color. So I apologize for the short video um, on Acadia, but basically, you know, I didn't get to open him on camera for you guys. However, I am going to open Wolfgang in an upcoming video. We just got Wolfgang as well. And I've, I waited so that you guys could see him being opened instead of just, you know, me sort of showing you. Uh, but anyway, this is Acadia, named after a national park in Maine, I believe. And he is a chestnut Sabino on the Vallegro mold with uh, two hind stockings, one front sock, or one front stocking, and another front sock blaze. And then he has Sabino spots. I'll take him off his base, actually, so you guys can see. He has Sabino spots and it says Acadia on his belly. My version, I've seen some people with um, get some with terrible horseshoes. Um, that's just something that happens with Briar, you know, the masking is a little off in some areas. Uh, my guy does not really have this problem. I think I kind of lucked out as far as horseshoes go. <laughs> I'm very picky about my dapples when I go to buy a horse. Uh, so for me, seeing dapples on just this area of him is really good. I don't like seeing dapples up on the neck or all the way up on the hindquarters or the back. It just seems like too much. And they don't have that weird honeycomb effect going on that some of Briar's other molds do. I'm really liking the almost ombre effect to his mane and tail. As you can see, it lightens as it gets to the bottom. And his mane is also lighter as well, almost giving him a little bit of a flaxen appearance. Um, but he is more, I would say, more red chestnut than he is flaxen. Um, in the pictures you'll be able to see this better, but he does have one blue eye on this side and one brown eye on this side. You know, doing the whole bicolored eye thing. It's very, very pretty on him, very fitting. So this is Acadia, and like I said, I'll make sure to put up some better pictures on, at the end of this video. I did take him outside today. It's absolutely gorgeous out there, 70 degrees and sunny in Upper Michigan, something that we don't get a lot of even during the summer. Um, but for now, Pony Pals, here he is. And I'm very excited to see the fourth edition in this series. Chances are that I'll end up with all four of them. I would love to end up with all four of them. I have a couple questions for you guys. What would you like to see as the final horse in the American Beautiful series? And on top of that, what do you think of Acadia and what colors would you like to see on the Vallegro? I know we have a dapple gray coming this year for Briarfest, but I was wondering if there was any other model or any other horse, portrait horse or uh, what have you that you guys think would look good on this mold. And I've actually got a custom one in progress down in the studio downstairs that I'll post some updates about on our website and such. Well, for now, Pony Pals, this is Acadia, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!
gonna be a short one.